Hello, this is Cheapy, and just want to give people some fair warning about using eDreams. Okay, there was so much to unpack here, but um, so let me give you the lowdown. So I think it was a year ago when I was trying to get a flight to the Philippines. And you know, I usually go to Google Flights to get my tickets. 99% of the time, it works 100%, except this one time. So when I was going to Google Flights and try to get tickets to the Philippines, and the first thing that pops up, so it's cheaper to the um, expensive, so you do that. So I got the cheapest tickets, and at that time, these tickets were going for a round, round trip like 950, plus with insurance was 75 bucks extra. So it was a thou around a thousand. And, you know, I got this nine months before my trip to the Philippines. So, so I got my tickets and, you know, all the conversation number and everything saying like, hey, you got your tickets, it's been confirmed. So you're going to Manila in December. So, yeah, that was awesome. But when I was trying to get, when, go to the airport, there was one big issue. Um... <laughs> E dreams did not get my tickets to the Philippines. So I was at the airport trying to find out what's going on. And <laughs> I talked to, it was, you know, connecting to American Airlines to Singapore Airlines to the Philippines. So I talked to American Airlines, gave them my information and stuff like that, and they're like, sorry, there's no record of you, you know, going on this flight, and there's no record of going there, so I'm like, okay, then I called Singapore Airlines, and Singapore Airlines said the same thing, then I was stuck at the airport, and I was like, okay, let me call eDreams, went all over this website, there was no number, only a robot to talk to you. So, and the nice lady at American Airlines kind of told me, yeah, like it's, I think you got scam and lost a thousand bucks. I mean, I managed to get it by bank, but that's not the whole point. I wasted nine months of planning of trying to go to the Philippines tri um, trip. So, yeah, that was a mess. But when you look at the reviews here, let me show it. Those people giving bad reviews. So I recommend do not take eDreams because this website will scam you. And I just want to get people information of how my experience was so that no one has to experience that. See this is all bs it would be nice if it was real but nope yeah don't even trust this website i hope this website gets shut down or this the scam company gets shut down because they have no right of ripping people off so that's my little incident thank you guys